Hello and welcome to another episode of As Told by Gonzo and yet again another special episode of Underrated Monday where every week I bring you an underrated movie that you, yes you, should watch. This week's movie is of course the Brady Bunch movie from 1995. If you don't know uh, what the Brady Bunch is, it was a family sitcom from the 70s. Uh, Mike and Carol Brady were both uh, like single parents. Uh, they each had uh, three children. Carol obviously having three girls and then Mike having three boys. They combined and you get the Brady Bunch plus Alice. Don't forget Alice. So essentially what the Brady Bunch movie is, is, is pretty much the Brady Bunch in the 90s. Um, they do live like a civilized 70s style. <laughs> What's really funny about the movie is uh, the scenes that are filmed actually inside the Brady house are actually filmed like a 70s sitcom. Very bright lights, bright colors, uh, just a different color palette. Um, but right when the Brady Bunch family goes into like the real world, uh, it's totally shot like a 90s teen comedy. Um, it's really odd. It's very subtle. I, I know they did it on purpose, but I actually didn't notice. There, there's a lot of things about this movie that I did not notice until I was older and watched it recently. Um, there's a lot of innuendos from like racism to sexism to like sexuality uh, innuendos. There's a lot of them and they're very subtle. Uh, it's more like they say it and then you're like, wait, Oh, what? Like, why would they say that? Uh, once again, the plot, the Brady Bunch family, uh, they're behind on their income taxes. Apparently, they haven't paid them for years and years. Uh, so they end up owing the government, like, $25,000. So throughout the movie, they try to figure out a way to come together as a family um, to raise this money before they're put out of their house and have to go live somewhere else. There's a lot of cameos in the movie, there's a lot of easter eggs, you know, different characters come back that were like, oh I remember that character from the TV show. Um, so a lot of people that grew up with the TV show will enjoy this movie and then a lot of people who aren't familiar with the TV show will stand alone movie itself is a really good movie. Uh, I think the Brady Bunch movie is one of those comedies from the 90's that was very overlooked. There's a lot of uh, shows uh, or movies that came out during the 90s that were based off TV shows, uh, particularly The Addams Family. Um, but I think The Addams Family did it right. The movie is just a 180 of what the show was. I, I know another movie that's based off a TV show is 21 Jump Street. I like how they take the show 21 Jump Street and then for the movie completely do a 180, uh, which is pretty much what they do with the, uh, with the Brady Bunch movie. It's a completely 180 different from the show. It's very funny, but it still pays, uh, you know, respect with the show. Uh, it's just more of a parody. It's making fun of itself. It knows it's not going to be, um, you know, they're not going to take this movie seriously. So they run with it. They make really, really, really funny jokes. A lot of the characters are just crazy. Um, Jan is going through this middle child syndrome where she, she knows she's a middle child and she's always behind Marsha. She can never do anything to get above Marsha. Everybody's about Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. And so Jan, through the movie, she's going through this stage where she doesn't know who she is and she's trying to find herself. I and mean, I think a lot of people who love the show will love the movie and a lot of people who don't aren't familiarized with the show will enjoy the movie as a movie itself. I do own uh, a DVD copy of the film and they did make another uh, sequel. It's called A Very Brady Sequel. Uh, it's okay. It's not as good as the first one. Uh, they also made a third sequel. Uh, the Brady's Go to the White House or something like that. I've, I've never seen it. Uh, I've only seen um, the first two, uh, but definitely watch the first one. Um, so if you ever seen the Brady Bunch movie, let me know below. Uh, so once again, thank you for uh, subscribing. Thank you for all the cool comments. Like I said before, I try to reply to every comment I get. I will see you next Monday for another Underrated Monday. Woohoo. That was really corny.